Hi Scorpio, I'm Jamila and welcome to the Venus Experiment channel and to your horoscope for the new moon happening Tuesday, November 26th at 7.05 a.m. Pacific time. So Scorpio, this month ahead for you, December really, is going to be all about your independence and really empowering your physical energy, your physical body. So maybe a new workout regimen or some new exercise plan. This is the time to do it this month. This Mars is in your sign, giving you some superpower warrior energy that wants to be channeled in a really healthy way because it's really stimulating your relationships too. So really wanting to create independence in your relationships. And if you're not aware of this, it's going to be happening anyway. So best to be aware that this is the month about you being this independent warrior and really starting this new way of embodying the warrior and being the strength and bringing it into your physical body. So you are the warrior and you are wanting independence. So if the people around you are bugging you or you're feeling irritable, yeah, that would really make sense because that's what's being asked of you right now is to be creating independence in your relationships while you step into and embody this warrior within. It's really coming out right now. So you want to get it out of your physical body. Be the warrior. So workouts, thats I keep thinking workouts is the best way to get this warrior energy out or in the bedroom. Yay, Scorpio, this is the time to get that energy out, to be in the flow, in your Scorpio flow, deep and big time, because it's Mars. It's about bringing it into your body, into your physical energy. So your physical energy is the warrior. You are the warrior. And so where are you putting that warrior energy, right? Because that's pretty powerful. So you don't want to be starting wars everywhere with this warrior energy. Make love, not war. But you can't be in bed the whole month either. So it's time to step out and be this independent warrior. And you can be a light warrior here, but it's about transforming your physical body. So this whole month of December, you're going to be changing your physical body. So channel this consciously because it's really connected to your relationships too. So creating, it's creating some instability in your relationships, some destabilizing energy for a reason in your relationship so you can be embodied in this powerful energy and really change up the way that you are in relationships, which means what's really changing is the way that you are with yourself. So your relationship to yourself is shifting and you're needing more space and independence. So really allow that, allow that this month and to get into this new warrior energy and find a good channel, a good outlet for it to come through your body and out because you don't want that warrior energy to get trapped either, right? It wants to get, it's a flow, it's Scorpio, so get it flowing. So flowing in your physical energy. And this new moon is really bringing out new potentials for making money, Scorpio. So if you are standing in your power, you are able to bring in this abundance that wants to come in for you financially. So this whole month of December, you're building new ideas. You're envisioning new ways to make money. Sagittarius is the seer. It's where we envision, we see the future. So you're seeing your new financial future. And so when issues of finances and money are up, remember that it's really about your self-worth 
that issues of self-worth can have a whole new perspective this month. And so it's about you allowing that to happen. So shift your mind about your self-worth and about your money and you can have a huge new beginning and great expansion and opportunities in the financial department. Blessings are coming in here for you this month. So envision it and feel it and feel this prosperity and this abundance and feel your self-worth, feel how worthy you are and how deserving you are of this abundance that can come in and believe in it and see it and know it and it'll come. So what an exciting month for you, Scorpio. So standing in your power, creating a new relationship with yourself and all the others in your life, shaking up your relationships so you can shake up your relationship with you. Stand in your power and get into your physical body and then shift your finances by having some new perspective about your self-worth and thinking about money, envisioning new ways of making money. But remember underneath, it's all about your self-worth. That's what it's all about. So know it, feel it, feel this abundance, feel that you're worthy because you are Scorpio and you've done such deep work, such transformative deep work in your, in your Scorpio time in the last month. And now you get to feel the big growth and change and this actual tangible results of financial flow coming into you. So see it and feel it and dream big. And it doesn't have to show up this month, but you're building your financial future, especially for the next year ahead and the next six months too. So really coming to fruition in May, the end of May. Okay, friend, I hope you have a beautiful, beautiful month and I hope to see you soon and check out all the information below and I hope to connect with you soon. Okay, bye.